Hey, welcome back, ladies and gents. I'm Zlevin, and this is, of course, Mitomasa the Demon Blade on the Nintendo Wii. And last when we left off, I had made it to the uh, gate in Mino, and I'm running around trying not to get killed. They got some new enemies that are pretty badass. Skeletons with uh, shining heads and guns and big samurai undead guys. It's pretty neat. Um, and there's these guys. What's up with that? Payback! Alright, that's it. No point in your sword. And you were down too. Good job. Hoping to see some more of those skeleton guys because they're pretty bad at. Whoa! See the background? It kind of looks like, uh, even though those are doors, it looks like. Is that glass? I don't know. That's pretty neat. <laughs> and we are... Whoa, what's up with this map? We're going up. There's a lot of places to go, so I'm going to be exploring as much as I can. What the hell? You see the background on that? Hold on. Yeah, I know you guys are going to kill me for this, but look at the background. See how it... <laughs> oh, man. It just keeps getting better and better. That's... That's one of the best things about this game, the way they uh, did all the art and stuff. Here's the big skeleton samurai guys. These guys are badass. Well, at least they were badass before I killed one of them. Oh no, get him! I was pressing the wrong button. I was like, just don't stand there. But yeah, I like those guys. They're pretty, uh, pretty neat. So where am I now? Looks like this room connects. But we are going to go this way first. Oh, look, a treasure. Culinary Tips Volume 3. Okay. Let's, uh, I'm gonna switch my weapon. Let that one recharge. Because it's... The last one's about to break, so while it's recharging, I can use a new one. And anyway, I like Misty Slash. Pretty awesome. So we're moving across. <laughs> Traveling to get the sword back for the old dude who's possessing her body. Whenever we get to that particular false person type thingy. Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? Haha! <laughs> Didn't know I knew that still, did you? Just die. Just die. Seppuku? Seppuku? Is that how you pronounce it? That's what he should have did before he even saw me. Can't even pronounce that word. If you don't know what it is, uh, Google it or something. <laughs> Although I should probably learn how to pronounce it before I even talk about it, right? Oh, that's a story for another day. Igarashi stone, so what does that do? Oh, was that even a... just an item? Hmm, sharpens blade and restores 50% soul power. Wow. Okay. I should probably remember some of these items. I just don't. I'll have to use them sometime in the near future, maybe. Eh, whatever. Ah. Hope you guys take my rat. You two, just lay down, please. Makes it so much easier for me. You guys are great. Thank you for coming to the party. Kind of reminds me of that. Uh, <laughs> when I when I think of stuff like that, I'm like uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger in Total Recall. He's like. Welcome to the party, John! When he throws them off the freaking uh, elevator thing when they're going up. Classic. Classic movie movie, movie quotes, if you will. Man, I need to go back and watch some of these movies. What the hell? So, which way am I going? I 
walked a lot of places. Obviously, we're going across, but... I was thinking somebody was going to drop that thing and I would drop down. Would have been neat, you know, if I would have had to run across and jump off before it fell, but they made it really simple, so that's cool, too. A lot of these samurai guys. Yeah, that's pretty good, but I get enough apparently. Lay down for me. I'll be in real serious uh, with my fighting now. After dying, since this game is hella easy, I shouldn't be dying. And this is this has got to be the boss. So how much time do I have? We're only five minutes in. How much soul do I have? Um, probably not enough to make a difference, but let's check and see. Well, I have a lot of souls, but I don't have a lot of spirit. And my strength of vitality still isn't high. Let's see if any of these items will make a difference. Those are just... Extra stuff. One of these days I'm gonna have to look into the whole cooking thing. Alright, let's see if we can get some new weapons before I do this. Even though I like the weapons I have now, having new ones won't hurt to me. 119, wow. So yeah, since I bought some of the uh, other blades before, I haven't gotten these story blades yet. But I should be able to go a hell of a lot farther down. So let's get this. It has 119 attack power. And it's a long blade, so that never hurts. Izuki Muramasa. And that has a swallow. Swallow Saw 2 secret art. The Moonlight Secret Arts kind of sucks ass. I never really cared for it. Hmm. But if it leads to this next story blade, then it might be worth it. 271. I don't have enough strength and vitality for that one. And this one's perfect. It's right on the mark, actually. Let's see. I can get this one, too. And this one. Tornado. It's either one or the other because I don't think I have enough. So, let's get this one. Aza Zakura Muramasa. And let me check. That's the combine. No, the rest of them look like they're. Uh... Yeah, I don't have enough. So, we are going to. Hurry up and do this so I can stop wasting time. I should probably keep the, uh, the the middle one is okay, but it's not really that good. So let's. Mm. Oh, that's right. That's that new blade. I don't think I've ever even used it yet. So I should probably switch out all these. They all got better attack power anyway. Oh, sorry to see you go, Yamabuki. So, Swallow Saw. Uh, Comet, and Absorb Life. And Tornado. And we're gonna save it. Yes. Alright. How much time have I wasted? I only got, what, like four minutes or something? Let's go. Yes. More story, more storyline. Odaikan-sama, kore wa hon no tsumara nai mono desu ga, o uke tori kudasai. Yamabuki iro no kashi ni gozaimasu. Mm-hmm. Manju no shita ni koban. Hmm? 
横流しの一件任せておけ、ええ、それにしても一チゴやそっちも相当の悪いよのいえいえ何をおっしゃいますやらお代官様ほどではございません<笑>んそこにおるのは何やつじゃ今の話を聞いていたな聞かれたからには生かしておかぬこの顔を見忘れたか四神男女浮世の鬼を斬るためにこの世に化けて出てきてやったぞ生きておるはずが桃姫の名を語る老関者めえい誰かおらぬか出会い出会いくせ者じゃはい、that that one、uh, dude that was sitting down he was hella fat <laughs> I was watching and I was thinking that the whole damn time 鏡家の姫の名を語るとは大胆な女族めこれだけの手勢相手にどうすることもできまい観念いたせ星満ち満ちたりといえども月の光に勝つことをあたわずうぬらの味じきり包丁が束になったところで恐れるに足らず It does kind of look like they're holding kitchen knives I'm just saying この城中で一年を争う手だれの面々を苦もなく切り破った老関者がこのようなあどけなき少女とはうぬらが生まれるずっと前より剣一筋に身を投じてきた尋常一様の剣技では後人を廃すのも無理からぬ話よとりつぶされた藩の家臣が今やとりつぶした抗議の手先利権を食い物にしておるとはおかしな話もあるものよ何もおかしくはない藩の内情に通じ政務を取るにふさわしい家柄壊れてこの職を引き受けたのだ小説な男じゃな自君に使えぬのが武士ではないのかまるで恥というものを知らぬと見える黙れ黙れ誰かこの女族を切り捨てい I love it when the bad guys say they have the pedigree to rule Right なぜじゃしかみ一体どうしてお主の言いたいことは分かっておるそう興奮するでないことの成り行きは読めたまずは見ておれ城の者がためらいなく切りつけてくるのはウヌが何か吹き込みおったからだな桃姫の名を語る女族めが大官の命を狙うておるとご中心申し上げたよくぞここまで生き延びてきたのう Alright, unless it's more storyline, I'm assuming that the next part is gonna have me fighting the boss So I'm gonna go ahead and stop it here guys Stay tuned for my next gameplay of Murder Masa. Until then, take care.